Often one of the problems in a dog bite case is that the owner of the dog doesn't have insurance. They Usually the insurance that applies to a dog bite case in Idaho will be homeowner's insurance. So if you have a renter who has a dog who doesn't have renter's insurance, um, or uh, somebody who is just is not living in or covered by any homeowner's insurance, you have this situation where there is no insurance coverage. Now, for a renter, sometimes um, you can actually get to uh, pass the renter to the landlord. If the landlord had a certain amount of knowledge about the dog or the dog's propensity or the history of the dog in causing damage to others, um, that is, you know, it's often difficult to get there, but sometimes you can get there and you need an attorney involved in that case to deal with it. If not, unless the person who owns the dog who doesn't have insurance um, has some personal assets that you can recover from, and that means what do they own? Do they have, um, you know, they own some land? Do they own something else that is of sufficient value to make it worth pursuing them for your losses? A lot of times these are the uh, worst types of cases because there is no place to actually recover the real damages. You know, these, these cases can be sad and tough, but we're happy to talk to you about yours if you want to give us a call.